Hey guys. Just recording some Destiny multiplayer for fun. Not even sure if I'm gonna post this. Look at this Only one path to victory, Guardians. Capture the zone. Destroy your enemy. I think the multiplayer is surprisingly good in this game. Actually, you have you tried it yet? No, I haven't tried it. It looks like fun though, because like the maps are pretty. I don't know. The maps are pretty interesting. I love this one. I love coming in. Uh, from the top, okay. like there was one time, I'll probably never be able to replicate this, and I don't think I'm just a liar. But there was one time I came from up there, and I there were three of their guys in here, and I uh, force punched, killed one, and then while the other two were confused, they didn't know what's going on. I shot them both in the head three times with this battle rifle. Tall tales with Stephen Patelsky. <laughs> it seriously happened. I'm not making that up. I wish I'd recorded that, <coughs> but um. I don't know, it's, <clears throat> it has like a great, so far for me what I've noticed about multiplayer, because in multiplayer it's interesting, like you can see there's a lot of range in levels, like there's a 9, I'm a 20, there's a 12, 7, uh, and that's all, I guess that's all turned off for the multiplayer, it doesn't matter what level you are, there's no advantage. Oh, you get your weapons. Boom, son! Yeah, but you, but you get to keep your, uh, the weapons that you get in the game. Uh, they don't. I don't. I don't know what. It, I, I guess they're they're not any more powerful, but they're. You know, you get the difference. Well, I have like a BB gun. But I don't think I would be very good at this. Boom. I mean, it shouldn't be any more. My guns, even though they are, they're they're very high level guns. They technically aren't supposed to be any more powerful than, um, like the uh, level ones guns. Oh. Yeah. Or else, or else it would just be the level, the highest level people, you know, destroying everyone every time. And that's not what it is, usually. There aren't really like a good number of, of different attacks and abilities. I think they kind of also only do <coughs> that's, yeah. that's, that's the thing, though. Like, I think the cool thing about these maps is, like, you could, in a lot of cases, there's a lot of different ways to get to a zone. Or to, yeah, to the objective. Ow. So you get, like, the sneak attack. Sweet. Uh, okay. Yeah, well... That and then um, for me, one of the coolest things is uh, like the the potential for multiple kills. I feel like is a lot higher in this than most other multiplayer. Yeah, games. I don't know why. That's definitely true. <clears throat> like uh, you know, your supercharge for sure is going to get you three, three or even four kills at once. Yeah, I mean, even like really a regular, your regular grenade. <clears throat> like, this is my favorite. Map. What is that? That thing where that guy like jumps down and does the like. Electric. That's a supercharge. That's, that's for the Titan. Yeah, that's like a pretty. I remember when we were we first started playing this. Like that guy, there's like one guy who just dominated. Uh, ah, he yeah. got. But yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know. It, like the definitely the mechanics of the game are, are very good. I mean, I guess it makes sense. These guys make Halo and everything, so they know what they're doing. But <clears throat> I don't know. I think the uh, the ability for multi multiple kills. Really takes the game up a notch for whatever reason. Like that guy you just saw, he just used a uh, supercharge. No! Ah! Oh, almost had that guy. Yeah. See, that was a good example of like, why I think they're going to play this style. It's like, some people have like high risk, high reward. You have like high risk, low reward. Mm -hmm. That's, kind of That's what I go with. So That's the plan. Like so. It's like, be really stupid and hope that you get killed. Yeah. That's always... Yeah. Wait, that. Hello! Oh, I missed... No, I killed him. Okay, good. <coughs> yeah, that was my super. Uh, I probably should have waited until there were a couple guys so I could... Ah, oh, God! No, no, no. That's good. I did neutralize that sound. Um, the only, I, it's the only downside, I like this game mode, there's only a couple downsides to the multiplayer so far, that I've seen. Uh, this is the best game mode that I've unlocked. I think there's one left that I haven't unlocked. The, I mean, it's all extremely standard shooter game modes. Uh, oh, ah, oh, uh, 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 Is there just like a team deathmatch? There's team deathmatch, there's, uh, free for all. Yeah. It's not, it's not as fun. I mean, I don't love to, I never love to do that much, generally, so. Um, 
there's a free for all mode, which is again not something I care for very much. And then there's like um, it's like hard point from Call of Duty. There's that type of mode. Uh, I haven't. There's one more mode, and I don't know what it is. No plants or zombies, unfortunately. So this yeah, is the first game. Like yeah, they're sort of like a. They're kind of like the flood. There's actually a lot in this game that's pretty much ripped off from the yeah. uh, Probably the best aspects of the game is just. It's fun. But like, uh, the, way, the way vehicles work are identical to, like, Halo 3. I say that's fun. <coughs> I like to not have to learn anything. Sort of the, uh, I'll you traveling that. around with a computer AI. <coughs> 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 I'm dying. Oh god. Yeah, this is see that, that's why there was no episode this week. Die already. Dang it. <coughs> oh god. Oh god. Um but yeah. Um but basically the, the only weak points are uh, the fact that there's only about five game types at all, and they're all just the standard what you'd expect from a shooter. I think it is still, oh, yeah, like, it's no pretty unfortunate, because I think, like, all these new, uh, generation games are still, like, dependent on multiplayer, and then they don't have, Well, this one's of... not, which is nice. Well, I don't know. I mean, when you get up to those island missions, I think more fun with the more people. Well, they're meant for, like, co-op, but they're not. Yeah, I mean, in that sense, they're... You're not necessarily supposed to play by yourself, although I've been playing mostly by myself. But they also seem really repetitive. Played a little bit with, they are very repetitive, but that's, I guess that's how, this is like MMO combines, combined with first person shooter. And that's how MMOs are, they're just sort of... You have to hunt boars in the forest for like 10 hours. Yeah, well that's just how these games go. I mean, it's it's not that bad though, I don't know. They're repetitive and all the, that, that's the other thing about the game that's sort of... A weak point is like, there's not a ton of original stuff to do all the time. Like especially even when there's new missions that are, are technically different from the old missions. I don't just really want to do. <clears throat> and then I die. Uh, even though there's new missions that aren't like, literally the exact same mission, they're basically all the same thing. It's like the, oh, there's this bad thing that we have to destroy. I mean, they and literally you made you do like a sword thing. mission, like. Well, you don't, like well, it's the same. It's the same sword mission, there, so you really only have one sword, which was actually what? pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, it's like so literally you the exact same. Got it that same. one time, and then came back, and it was just it. Really <coughs> you just play the exact same mission again, so except it was—I was, was, think it was a higher level, higher level guys, but um, yeah. I mean, I think that was like a daily, whatever, daily challenge mission for today. Maybe it was maybe you put them in the same day, just let you play the phone. That's a good Die. Yes. Yes. But it's pretty fun. I'm not bad at it. Um, I mean, that's just you with these kind of games, you know, it is kinda of like the South Park episode. You're just trying to get whatever. Yeah, you're just trying to get points to level up. Uh and you just continue to level up and level up. It's also like a <coughs> it just goes on so forever and ever. I have to bring you a bucket to, to yeah, that happened. Mm -hmm. It was. Uh. Wow, that kind of anyway. Yeah, now that we've had the defecation joke. Yeah. Um. <coughs> basically, what was the other weak point that I Can found out? Oh, so, uh, yeah, it hasn't been working very well. As one of the probably the few people who sat online playing this for like 20, probably put. Oh god, no, you're still alive. Why? Uh, for one of the people that continually played this game for like three days straight, in between, you know, doing writing pieces for work. Um, die, die, die! Why aren't you dead? Had some backup there, teammates. Um, yeah, but for some reason, like during the day, you can never actually get into the multiplayer. Only at night does it ever actually work. It's worked today, uh, during the day on the weekend. Um, so I guess that's fine. Although everything else would work. Like, For efforts like that, we might just win this. Thank you. 
um, you know, like the missions would work, even though it requires you to be online for those, but it wouldn't match you with other people. And so I don't, I don't know what the deal was. Maybe their servers just, just weren't working right. But that was the other thing. Uh, well, there's one more. There's one more. Oh, there's just not a lot of, of options, really. I didn't get anything. Oh, that's why your character is pink. No. What? Right. No, he was, he was purple for a little while. Oh. It's not pink. He's blue now. Oh, so you change the pink Eventually, you can get these shaders. <coughs> and so, I have a purple. Give me a purple one first. So you change that for your shaders. Eventual royal. And then I finally get Achilles or whatever. Yes. Mine is uh, flamboyant, I guess. But uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's look through our stuff. Basically, it's like an MMO in that you get. Oh, cool. I got a good, a better helmet. That's weird. I don't get a better helmet. Yes. You, get <coughs> you get rewards for doing stuff. I got one legendary. This is the highest level thing I think you can get. Is these, see how they're like color coded? Green is uncommon, blue is rare, and purple is legendary. I have one legendary thing. This is far much, but Rachel got on like a level four mission that she played this morning. This is like a level four patrol mission of all things. Ooh, I have something with light. I guess that's what this is. I don't get light. I, I haven't figured out the... Oh, I, I'm level 21 now. When did that happen? Wait. No, yeah, see, it's level 20, but I have 21 light. I don't know. The leveling system's a little confusing, to be honest. And the story, frankly, is completely incoherent. I beat the story, I guess, because the end of it involves you, like, blowing up the heart of... The heart of darkness going into the heart of darkness and destroying it. Control. <clears throat> uh, Bravo team. It's on Mars instead of in the middle of Africa. But, <clears throat> but uh, yeah, you, what is that? Oh. oh, ah, ah, oh god, god, come on. Oh yeah, you can. Um, there's a little bike, but it's it's not really useful for anything but driving around. Oh, this is the level from the beta. I feel like I haven't played this very much at all. You can't, you can't shoot anyone with the bike or hit them. Ooh. Yeah, I feel like it's just a little long. These bikes shoot things, but you can't get them except in extremely rare circumstances. Like this. Destroy this one. Yeah, actually a lot from the beta didn't show up in the game. <clears throat> that was another annoying thing about the game. It did, your progress from the beta didn't transfer over at all. So you just had to replay everything. For eight eight levels. Yeah, which was like, time. God. That was annoying. It, it's obviously, none of these shortcomings are nearly enough to say, don't buy this game. This game is clearly, clearly the best game available right now. By far. I mean, Plants vs. Zombies is awesome. Um, but this is, this is obviously more of a serious game. Oh god. <laughs> I mean, that's more like a fun thing. It's, it's awesome, but it's, but this is a more serious thing. Oh god. Uh, strategy on No, there is. I mean, you don't use it, Oh. I'm just talking about your, your game. Uh -huh. like you're, not, you're not like plumber material. So. <laughs> I like being General Supremo. Besides the cool General name. General Supremo is slightly the same as that color. Oh, God. <laughs> but, uh. Yeah. Don't it would have been, been nice if. Oh. What? Zone a lost. What just happened there? How? Oh. I am in shock. That was ridiculous. High risk, low reward. I really like the environments in this game. They're really cool. That was probably, yeah. I mean, that's one of like the sad things about the fact that it doesn't have a good story and they could have done like 
Mm-hmm. Interesting things with characters and like the environments. Oh yeah, the s- they don't really do anything. Right. So. Let's okay. check the story for a second. So it's completely incoherent, basically. There's a dead place behind. No, how are you not dead yet? How did how did I not get that? Zone A, secure. Oh, Total control. Good work. Man, this rifle's not doing anything. Phil, he's over there, buddy. There he goes. Um, yeah, the story. So, one problem with the game is like, I think, I'm not positive, but I think you can skip st- st- uh, story missions. Because first of all, there's a lot of missions that you go on in this game. At any given time, you can go on like 15, 15 or 20 different missions. And so it's easy to sort of get lost. I'm sure there's still like level 3 and level 4 missions I never played because of that. But, um, yeah, I mean, <clears throat> I don't know if I've missed stuff, but... So the story is basically, uh, you know, this the traveler comes and it's this big white ball and it's like super good and it makes humanity awesome for several centuries and then um, and then the, the darkness, which is its the light's enemy, the traveler's enemy, came and like killed everything sort of almost except for this one city. Zone B, lost. And then that's where you come in, you're a guardian. Kind of racist. Right, of course. But Die, guy. Die, thank you. Um, hmm. Hmm. I see no one else. Okay. Zone B, uh, <clears throat> and, and so the game... So it's a, you know, it's a generic good versus evil thing, but... They describe the darkness as though it's like this single entity, like the Traveler is. Like, the Traveler's a big ball in the sky. It's like a big planet that floats over Earth. And then the darkness, I don't never really understood what the darkness was, other than, in, in practical sense, it seemed to be like just a collection of bad guys, bad groups, bad races, and aliens. But they were they don't work together, they're not fighting together, they're just Yeah, they fight each other. Too. So that's why it didn't make a lot of sense to me. And then the so the I don't know, I don't wanna spoil it, but the ending makes no I don't know. The the ending you basically just destroy one of the races, sort of. You destroy their like hot their like spawning facility. Yeah. Or something. And that's why, but, uh, yeah, and that that's clearly the end, and you get, like, a special gun, this gun, actually, I'm using is what they gave me at the end of it, but, I don't know, it didn't, <clears throat> it just was super incoherent to me, oh god, why, why are you shooting at that, why are you so stupid, you drew me into that, Shoot you, guy, you're shooting a hand cannon at a freaking, uh, turret, Dude. Unless you buy a revolver at this turret that's two miles away from me. Get my friends killed because they think I'm not anything. I'm going to do something stupid. Ah, no! Speaking of which. Dang it! Um, but yeah. And then basically, I think I mentioned this earlier, but basically the... The plot is just... Every mission is basically... The only one that has guns. I was trying to do earlier, but I got rudely shocked and moved the face. Well, let's see which one of us work. No, no, that wasn't even close. Alright. They should have moved around some. Anyway. Uh, yeah, every mission is basically, oh, there's this super evil thing that's going to destroy everything unless we go find it and kill it or destroy it. And that's every single mission. Oh, I'm going to get stuck. Did I die yet? Oh, yeah. Okay. 
And so it's a little bit uh, dumb, I guess. There's not a lot to the story of this game, which is kind of sad. Because they dance. put. Dance. Oh, yeah, you can dance. Dance, guy. Dance with me. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. That's right. Look at this. Your dance sucks. I don't like my. Why do they give. Why do they give us. I like this dance. You have the robot. Uh, yeah, your dance is better. She's a... What are you... Well, I'm a warlock. That's what this guy is. I think I actually... This guy over here that we're looking at, this is uh, what Rachel's character is. What, are, what is it? Oh, I guess I, yeah, I guess I changed it to Titan. Oh, that's Titan? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I was like... I thought you were the other thing. The Blade something? Blade Walker? Oh, wait. Yeah, I can't remember. Hmm. <coughs> anyway. Well, yeah, I guess Tosca's I did change. Yourself. I did change to a Tosca, you're ruining the audio. You're scratching. Oh god, that guy's still there. Maybe if I duck. Yeah? Oh, what is hitting me? Oh, <laughs> this grenade right in front of me. <laughs> Damn, Hi, honey. Stop doing that. Stop scratching. Don't tell me what this is. What's stuck in the dog? Nice. Yeah. Enemy captured zone B. That's not enough. Uh, and then, yeah. What was I saying? Yeah, so the, the story you is kind of um, weak. Which is sad for like a, what is this, a $500 million game that already made back its money on like its first day? No. <laughs> it's totally a great game. It's just like even the Halo story is better than this. And Halo is pretty. Maybe maybe it's just in the first one. I, I guess the Halo story in the first one's not anything like, special. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it seems like a lot of them still have stories. Yeah. Because they're still just like I don't know. Yeah, it's just like the new engine is giving them lots of different things to do, so they think they can kind of coast from the bank. That's what your zombies have a good story. Only five yeah. minutes left. Oh, it's plants versus zombies. Yeah. This crazy guy it's with the garden. There's sentient plants, and then a zombie boss. Oh, well, now you have, like, conspiracy theory about how Dave goes in the middle of the fight. Yeah. The What's with that? What's with that, Dave? Just Dave. What you know? They he was he he done living gardens and fight for him. I know. What is going on there? But yeah, that's for another episode. I'll spray him. We're talking about. Um. Oh, die, 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 die. No, die. Why? Oh, you know what? Uh, so I I heard there's a lot of really famous voice actors in this. Um, like Nathan Fillion. Billion? Billion? Whatever. The guy from Firefly. For the other non Adam Baldwin guy from Firefly. He uh <clears throat> he played he plays a character in this. He's like one of the band guards, which is like I think is one of the people that when you go and get like um armor. Oh, wait, wait, for which one? For the I thought it was for the warlock, but I think that's a woman. <coughs> yeah, the warlock was a woman. <coughs> So it must be one of the other ones. <coughs> one from my class. Yeah. It might be. It might be. That. But he, yeah, he doesn't really say. So I didn't hear him, and yeah, I don't really talk very much. But there's one really famous guy that's definitely the speaker, the guy that speaks for um. The donor. The guy that Don't speaks see. for. Oh, the speaker. Traveler. Speaks for the traveler. He's the guy from. Enemy captured zone C. Uh, well, Don't about see. time is the last. Movie that he's the father in about time, but that's not a very well known movie. Uh, Underworld. He's the. Uh, uh, he's like the ultimate vampire in Underworld. He's the boss vampire. That she fights in the first or in the first or second one. I don't remember. He's a famous actor. He's British. Uh, he's he's the speaker. There's supposed to be a couple other famous people, but I haven't heard any of them. Even though I've played this game for like 50 hours, I actually think he's the one talking right now. Enemy captured zone B. No, maybe that's not. Oh, good. What? How did I do this? 
How did I? No. What? Someone come and kill him. How did He's I do so it? Funny. How did I do this? Someone come kill him. No. Yeah, no. Come on. Get out of it. Kill him. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's so funny. How did I get in here? Get me out. How is this possible? <laughs> I tried to grind that rail and it didn't work out. Go! 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 You're not... Come on, go. You're not going. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> how did I... How did it get stuck there? Unbelievable. Anyway... I would add that to the thing. <laughs> how did it get stuck there? Yeah. Yeah, Rachel is... Created a Tumblr. Did you mention this in the show before? Uh, I did, but I don't have the web address. Actually, I don't want to get the web address. Yeah. You gotta get on top of that. Yeah. I don't know. Yep. You're like the thing where you. <laughs> this the thing where you make fun of me. Isn't oh, it's still there. Isn't uh. Well, you're not serious about it. You're not serious. About it. Go. Well, I wanted Good. to uh, add a couple more posts to it. <clears throat> No. Oh god. Well, I'm an idiot. One minute. I wish I had a rocket. Oh, wow, this is so good. Uh, I think they're pretty, uh, yeah, that's true. I think it's because of the They're pretty long it's games. Long. Oh, yeah. oh boy. No idea what's happening. Zone B neutralized. Dang it! You've got 30 seconds. Coronation! Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I want to use my supercharge for this game. I always. I hate. I hate forgetting to use it. You don't just have it for it. Well, you can do that at B. Yeah, well, I'm never going to make it there in a couple of seconds. Enemy captured zone. The double jump's a little wonky in this game, too. You can use your sparrow. Yeah, but that takes a while to call off and then... Uh, uh, one kill. Uh, single victory doesn't won. War, won. It's a good start. Yeah, let's good dance. Oh, no, I'm done. <laughs> you can play for a couple seconds after you win too, which is kind of cool. I think actually in the missions, sometimes if you search around after you win a mission, you can find extra stuff. Uh, crates and unlockables. But yeah, overall, great game. Uh, multiplayer is a lot of fun, mainly because of the... I mean, it's real balanced, but also you, there's a lot of potential for, like, multi-kills. Really epic ones. And so I've been having a lot of fun with it. <clears throat> Just oh, overall, awesome game. Oh, funny books. Mm -hmm. Oh, back in the day. Oh, mm -hmm. days ago, it was like all the <laughs> But uh, go out and buy it, play it, join me in playing it, and we'll have fun together. And you can kill Steve when he gets stuck on between, like, uh, elements on the map. Yeah, which is apparently a long time. Apparently it takes longer time than I thought it would. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys.